Give me a moment, guys. I'm trying to find a live broadcast <laughs> on this page. Uh, Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> okay, so my bad. I accidentally did the live on my own Facebook page and I thought it was on the Macross Delta one. So um, I didn't start anything, I was just setting up. Yeah, so if you're wondering why I'm lagging to talk to you guys, it's mainly because um, my feet off my laptop is actually slower than what I'm recording to you guys. So I'm actually checking right now to see um, if anything is wrong or anything I need adjusting. Like, um, I think I may need to zoom. So I don't know whether I should be able to zoom. Yeah. So you can see my whole messy room right now. So is this is this distance okay? Yeah, it seems fine. Okay, so like there are 8 people but I can only see 2 people who are watching uh, Mainly because those 2 people are actually under my friend list on my own account So there's 11 people which is awesome now Okay, so if you're wondering, yes, my room is like a horde of mess as you can see from the background. Um, <laughs> so anyway guys, enough about my room and my messiness. Um, let's get down to the main thing today. Uh, so basically... Okay, the words are not coming out of my mouth. <laughs> Alright, so today... Basically, we are going to pick whatever prizes the six selected people um, are going to win. So I'm going to toss this aside because the, the, the lag in the voice is actually annoying my uh, train of thought. So, uh, you want to show me your room, Franklin? <laughs> uh, well, I haven't showed you the floor, so... <laughs> <laughs> Basically, you're just looking at this stack of mountains that I have. Um, the pathway to my room and my bed is like one linear path. So, uh, <laughs> anyway guys, so congratulations again to the six selected people who are going to win something away today. Um, as for the items posting postage, um, it will be covered by me. But of course, I'll only send the items out uh, after I've gotten details from you guys. So here's the first step I need the six of you to uh, do. Um, if you're not watching the live broadcast now, it's fine. Uh, I just need you guys to make sure you watch it later on. Especially for one of the winners, uh, Alison Wendell. Sadly to say, I'm not able to tag you on this video because of your uh, Facebook privacy. Um, you're you apparently set it to a uh, to a private ma uh, manner that I cannot even tag you on any of the posts. Uh, I cannot, yeah, I cannot notify you at all. So if you are watching this later somehow, please update me ASAP um, because I need your address and I need your uh, details and particulars that you wish to have uh, being used to mail you the item to you. So. For all the six selected people, after this video, do PM me on Facebook uh, privately. Uh, let me know your um, name that you wish to use for your postage. 
um, and your full address uh, that includes your postal code and you know your street name and all that stuff uh, so I will post out the items uh, as soon as I can when I'm free uh, probably not so soon in the next few days maybe another week or so mainly because I have been busy with work and then probably with more YouTube content that's coming up soon I have an unboxing that I would love to do you just give me a sec um, all right oops <laughs> okay so I got this from one of the admins on another Facebook page uh, who is also a member on this Facebook group so if you guys know um, the sky tree event has ended recently so this is gonna be an unboxing video of this wonderful goodie here so and the exclusive can badges that were in the tokyo sky tree event so look out for that video in the future um so yeah um that i think this is like a full complete set of 10 badges so um that's wonderful if there are any spares i probably might give them away um but only to the local fans i'm so sorry guys <laughs> um because <laughs> postage to overseas is uh, expensive uh, especially for those who are in the states um i can expect to pay like maybe the same amount of price that the item may cost um that, that's just ridiculously expensive but you know uh, once in a while it's fine um, but if you do it constantly, it is gonna be a pain. So yeah, <laughs> everybody is like going, I want, I want. <laughs> uh, yeah, so anyway guys, uh, congratulations to the six people. I'm gonna read out their names again, just in case you haven't been updated before. So the first person who was picked, uh, I won't mention who are the admins who actually picked your names. Um, let's keep that as a mystery. So the first person, Daniela Di Silvia. Um, if you are in the live broadcast right now, congratulations to you. Then the next one will be Kylie Peak. Then of course Cecilia, and of course uh, Anissa, who is also known in Facebook as Hisa. Um, then Ellison Wendell. Of course, I couldn't tag you, so hopefully you watch this video somehow. Um, then Franklin Fang, uh, my bro, uh, under the broadcast team. I'm, I was quite surprised to see your name, to be honest. <laughs> when I was like, huh? <laughs> okay, because the admins were like joking about um, they purposely make you an admin for the group so that you couldn't participate and win the prize. Mm. <laughs> so uh, what? I'll pay the postage to, uh, here in the States for me. No, 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 you don't have to pay. It's, 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 it's all covered by me. Um, this, uh, because, you know, um, this is, this is my, my way of saying thanks to the Macross community for helping my YouTube channel grow. Uh, it's still growing. Um, right now I'm currently at 427 subscribers, which is fantastic. Uh, hopefully within another month or so, I will reach the 500 mark and I will be surprisingly enough doing another giveaway for that. Uh, of course, if you're wondering if it's a Macross related item, yes it is. So look forward to it and it's gonna be two items but only one winner. So, um, if you're wondering what the two items is, it is something to do with uh, an announcement that was recently done. Uh, just think Apple. <laughs> so I'm giving you the hint there. Uh, <laughs> so yes. Um, if you can find, if you can guess what it is, just leave your answer in the comment section down below and I'll see who has it right. <laughs> okay, so with that six announced, uh, sorry, six people being announced correctly. Uh, what? I just realized, am I the only guy that won? Yes, you're the only guy that won, Franklin. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah, so strangely enough, we we do have a lot of male Macross fans, but uh, majority of the ladies actually won. <laughs> uh, I guess they're good with their words. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, so... Uh, no, not that Apple iPhone, Kenneth, you ass. <laughs> no, I'm not that rich. <laughs> uh, okay, so... We're gonna go down with um, the main... Thing that we're supposed to do today so basically i've already drawn the lines for the six of you and your names at the top right now um i'm still deciding 
what prices are to be um, put at the bottom here. Um, so yeah, so there is only five can badges and one book. Of course, the book being the main price. So right now, um, I'm gonna require one of the admins um, to actually set up a poll on the Macross Delta page. Um, from there, we're gonna uh, select the main spot that will have the book in that position. So basically, all right. So since there are only six people here, we're gonna do a poll for one, the number one to six. You're gonna choose which number you love the most. And within after maybe about three minutes, I will check the poll, and from there, uh, we we'll, we we'll make use of that position with I mean the pos the number that has the most number of number of selected, uh, choices, um, and I'll place the book there. So from there, then we will choose whether how many lines of bridges will be drawn between, uh, each of the names. Then from there, we will see who's the lucky winner who will win or walk away with the book. So um. Alex, I think if you're watching, you, you can go ahead and toss the poll up on the Macross Delta page now. So, um, I'll just keep watch of the um, Facebook group and hopefully from there, um, yeah, we will see what number has been selected. Uh, Nathan, you can actually buy an iPhone. <laughs> you don't need people to give it to you. Uh, I don't know in the states whether they have like phone plans and all that. Usually in um, in my country and or rather, um, the country around us, uh, around me as well, um, the mobile subscribers do have phone plans. Let's say if you sign up for a phone line, um, it does have a data plan that comes bundled with a phone, uh, at a discounted price. Of course, uh, that depends on how much you're paying monthly for your phone bill. So, um, I'm not sure whether the state has those. So you can actually get an iPhone under like an installment plan or that kind of thing. But um, depending on whether you are financially stable to obtain an iPhone or not. Of course, most people in my country are generally Android users. Uh, mainly because they like the um, easy functionality of Android phones. Easy to drag and drop items into the phone. But of course, Android phones, the battery life is shit. And... Um, well, the OS is very, um, how you say, prone to viruses. So uh, that's one of the main reasons why I stick with iPhone because of security and well, I, the iOS isn't exactly very difficult to use. Um, people complain only about using iTunes for iPhone to sync anything into the phone. But generally, once you've gotten used to it, it's pretty simple. So, you know, each their own. Okay, so let me check the Facebook group um, and see whether um, the poll is up or not. <laughs> uh, give me a sec, guys. Okay, so yeah, the poll is up. Um, so far, we've only got two people selecting. Um, why is there one more option? Oh, okay. <laughs> so so far the numbers selected is three and five. Um I'll give you guys another maybe two minutes um to, to do a selection. If not, uh then we'll stick with whichever number that has the most selections uh choices being made, you know. So let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna check some of the comments from the Facebook as well. Because a lot of people are like, well, a few of you guys are actually struggling with the latest event in Utah Macross, and I'm not surprised. Um, I I am I myself am struggling with it, um, because this event is really really brutal. Uh, <laughs> uh yeah. So it's yeah, most of you guys have probably realized by now that this current event you need to be. Like what what Chung Fa has mentioned here, you need to be a whale. You need to toss in money into Uta Macross like you literally have tons of cash on you that you know. So uh yeah, this this event is very, very brutal. Um so yeah. Huh. Okay, so uh did anyone else outside of this Macross Delta group win a selected position? 
I think it's only everyone in this Macross Delta group, even though the admins did post um, the uh, giveaway announcement in the other Macross groups like Macross SG, Macross Malaysia, um, there is another Macross Delta page also run by the same admins. Uh, yeah. Oh, Chung Fa is here. <laughs> Take skill. Yeah. So, yes. If you can't, if you guys can't actually play extreme, uh, and full combo it, then we are all stuck with very hard, and then of course, that's the amount of score we can get. So that's kind of sad. Um, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I didn't know you were a new member. I thought you've been around for very long. <laughs> well, um, yes, it's true that I did mention that you have to be a member of this group to join the contest. So if you guys were from another Macross group and then you joined this one, well, you are eligible to take part. But apparently not a lot of people did. Um, they did, they did see the announcement, but uh, they didn't really join the group. Or they didn't even subscribe to me as well. Uh... So yeah, when you change the EX, it stays there and doesn't go up anymore. Uh, yeah, well, it doesn't go, it doesn't give you another um, level of the EX difficulty. It's because you need to hit a required score to unlock the level. Uh, I'm stuck at level 21. Because I can't go to level 22 because it requires like a uh, 1,400, no, it's 1,400,000 points then to unlock level 22. So that's pretty ridiculous in my case because I don't have plates that are good enough to unlock that kind of score. So yeah, there are people I heard that spend tons of money for good plates but having no skill can Yeah, that's true. Um, yeah, in the past, having good plates means uh, bragging rights. So, um, I know a ton of Japanese players who actually spend thousands of dollars, literally thousands of dollars on Uta Macross. And um, they have six star plates that are like plus 20 luck. Which is ridiculous. And we're not talking about the standard plates. We're talking about those with like a total average score of 3,005 and above. So those are ridiculously powerful plates. Um, but yet, they can't play extreme. So it's kind of sad uh, that so much money is tossed into the game. But without technique and skill on music games, your level... Well, it's gonna stay stagnant in that position, so that's kind of sad. Uh, uh, average score is 1.4 million. Mm, sadly to say no. Um, if you're talking about people with generally good plates, yes, average score is 1.4 million. But if you're talking about free to play, average score is nine. Um, not even a million. Uh, it's it's within the nine hundred thousand range. So, no, the, that's not the average score. And the average score is not one point four million. It really depends on each person individually, or whichever group of category of players you are in. Um. So yeah. <laughs> Hisa just messaged me and like um wait for me. I'm still in the middle of photo class. Okay. Um, I don't mind waiting for you. Um, I'm still waiting for the results of the poll. <laughs> Oh, you mean the overall event, um, total average score? Yeah, that's the yeah, mainly because there's only like a handful of people who, um, are able to hit, um, okay, a uh, top score for one song, the highest I've seen, is three million four hundred thousand, the highest I've seen, and we are talking about um, Shudi Star, <laughs> and that's ridiculous, uh. Yeah, so um, then for the slightly lower than top players, um, the average score is about 2 million, uh, 200,000. Then, of course, slightly lower than that is about the 100 and uh, what, 1 million and 600,000. So, 
Um, then of course it's within my category. We are within the uh one million two hundred thousand range. Then from that, uh, there are even more um, I would say um unluckier free to play players. So they are around the nine hundred thousand range. So yeah, uh, I I've, I've been stuck in the twi- uh the the level twenty one as well. Uh, I have level twenty one unlocked. Uh, but it's it's just that the. Uh, the total score to beat the EX level is ridiculously high so I don't try playing level 21 I'm stuck at level 20 uh, at least I am still able to beat the EX level uh, rivals so yeah um, if you guys are wondering what we are talking about we're talking about Uta Macross uh, if you guys are Macross fans and don't play Uta Macross I highly recommend you to play Uta Macross especially if you love uh, Macross music um, and the divas uh, well they dance for you so you know <laughs> um yeah all right i'm gonna check the poll um i've given you guys ample time i think that's like past nine or ten minutes already um let's take a look uh where's the poll <laughs> the poll disappeared hold on i'm gonna refresh the page where is the poll okay so all right so we've come to a draw Surprisingly, um, between five and three. Come on, guys. Um, now you're only allowed to select five and three right now because two and six is definitely too low. Um, so for whoever who has selected two and six, please make your choices at five or three. Um, and whoever who hasn't voted, please vote under five or three so that we can move on. Uh, whichever number has been selected with the most amount of votes, we will choose from there. Yeah, so uh, I'll give you guys another three minutes to make your decision. So um, let me go back to the um, live feed. It's such a hassle to switch uh, between the live and the poll. I'm just gonna open another tab. <laughs> um, Chung Fa, you can vote uh, at the Macross Delta page. You might have to exit the live if you're on a mobile device. Um, but if you guys are on Facebook on the PC, you can actually open another tab and go back to the Macross Delta page. The poll is there. Um, so yeah. Uh, just just refresh the page. You should be able to see the poll somewhere at the top few posts. Yeah, so five is winning. Oh, that's cool. Let's see. I should refresh my page to see the latest results. Uh, it still shows me three three on five. Or oh, am I looking at it wrong? Oh, okay. Five has five people. Okay, so. 3 has 4 people. Alright, so seems like 5 is winning. Alright, uh, thanks Alex. Um, is everyone selected? There are like 7 people watching. I can only see like a few people, um, few people's names because these guys have added me personally on Facebook. Uh, if you guys are planning to request me to add you on Facebook, um, do take note, I'm pretty strict on whoever is under my friend list because um, if you guys are just adding me for the sake of um, <coughs> adding me because of news and all this, please don't. Um, I am only adding friends if you are bothered to like communicate with me and be part of my life. If you are not, then I just uh, highly recommend you just follow the post on the Macross Delta page. So yeah. Um, Hey Kaylee, Kylie. <laughs> oh, sorry, I butchered your name again. Uh, going to be the outcast. <laughs> uh, nobody's an outcast. Um, everyone is pretty well connected here in the Macross Delta group, except for those who just um look at posts and um react on posts. Uh, they don't really communicate. Uh, oh Kaylee, okay. <laughs> Uh, 
Alright, so let's check the final results, then we'll end the poll here. Okay, we've got 6 people on 5, and we have 5 people on 3. So we're gonna go with the 5th slot that the book will be on. So I'm gonna draw um, it on the book. So uh, I actually went out purposely to buy like a whole set of coloured markers just for this. Um, this will come in handy again soon. <laughs> so, um, just give me a sec. Let me. What color you guys want me to use? Um, there's like a whole range here. I I mean it's not the full color of range that you can find in Copic markers, but these are good enough. You know, I I really like this Japanese brand. So, um, for those who like do, um, I would say, what do you call it again? presentations you know using like um, charts and all this uh, for school yeah this brand of marker is pretty awesome so and and they're not too expensive comic markers are freaking expensive so yeah there is pink there is pink you know um there's pink there's red there's this pink uh, and then there's red so yeah i like the pink because it reminds me of makina um sadly to say they don't have all the full colors of rock gray here um Oh wait, they do. <laughs> so we have like Valkyrie color here. So that's pretty nice. Then of course um, there's blue for Hayate and black for Mesa. <laughs> Come on, guys, choose a color. Uh, choose two colors. Um, so far I've seen like red, pink, purple. Um, so there's only three colors selected so far. Uh, I just need two colors. So one color will be used for the book, then the other color will be used for the can badges. So I'm just gonna indicate. Um, yeah. Purple. I see two purple. Well, it's by for the same person. Come on. I know you Miku more fans, so go. <laughs> Pink. Red. No one. Am I liking on you guys' uh, mobile devices? Ping, 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 then purple. <laughs> okay, so since I see a lot of the word pink <laughs> and purple, pink for the book so it stands out. <laughs> purple. So pink and purple. Black. <laughs> no. <laughs> So, I see a lot of pink and I see a lot of purple, so okay, we're gonna go with pink and purple then. Um, yeah, so I think pink is the most outstanding color, so that will be for the book. Um, so, it was the fifth position, right? So, let me just toss this aside. So, under, El under the name Allison is the book, but Allison may not win the book. <laughs> so, uh, let's all... Bet on the, you know, bet on chance. So, okay, I'm gonna draw stars. I'm gonna draw stars. Yeah, can you guys see it? I don't know. Is it bright enough? Uh, I'm just checking my live feed, just in case. Um, it's kind of slow. Oh, okay, I can see it now. Okay, so. Okay, I'm gonna draw. Um, I'm gonna draw circles for the can badges. So at least it's just one big block of purple. But I have a feeling that the color contrast may be a bit too. Um, similar. Uh, yeah, the life is lagging, so give me a sec. Yeah, it looks kind of like black, so... <laughs> um, so sorry guys for the Mikumo fans, but you know. Um, it looks black because it's dark purple. Uh, I guess only when you... I can see it's purple on my own eyes, but probably for you guys in the life feed, it's gonna look black. But oh well. I'm gonna use the thick end because it's easier to draw a block this way all right
right. Okay, so from here, we have finally selected the items that are placed at the end. All right, and we're going to do another poll. From here, I need you guys to select which are your favorite numbers from the numbers 6 to 12. So the admin will actually put up a poll from 6 to 12. Um, you're going to select which is your favorite number. From there, we're going to draw lines you know, to connect between here. And hopefully, from there, we will see who actually wins the book. So uh, the same thing as just now. Uh, just check the Macross Delta page for the poll. Hopefully, it's up um, soon. Um, thank you, admins, again for the um, hassle. Um, for you know assisting me on this live broadcast thank you guys so much all right I'm gonna refresh the page just to check to see whether it's up okay it's not up yet Initially, I wanted to play music in the background, but um, my devices that are linking to my Bluetooth speaker um, will clash in audio. <laughs> I initially wanted to use my phone to play music, but when I went back into the live mode, it actually cut off my, my music, so that's kind of irritating. <laughs> oh, 7 to 12? No, no, 6 to 12. 6 to 12. Um, six lines to twelve lines, yeah. So okay, the poll is up. Um, let me check the poll. Okay, we've got two votes on eight. Oh, you guys like eight? My favorite number is eight too. <laughs> the caps and read me. I read you, okay. Uh, I just had to check the uh, the main page, so I couldn't see the comments. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I see the Chinese word pa. Yeah, so um, pa is like eight in Chinese. So language lesson here for you guys. And uh, in Japanese is uh, hachi. So, still two votes on the number 8. I'm going to refresh. Uh, we've got four votes on number 8. One on 10. One on 11. So, okay. Um, so far, what do you guys think about this? Um, well, price selection method. Uh, I just need your comments and um, thoughts about it because... I thought it was pretty fun when I decide, uh, when I thought of it. Um, is it fun for you guys? Because I might use it in the upcoming um, way of purchasing the Ichiban Kuji if you guys are interested. So I, if you guys aren't familiar, uh, just give me a sec guys. I'm going to find the Ichiban Kuji. Uh, give me a sec. Yeah. So yeah, if you guys aren't familiar, because I've actually done a video, a uh, live broadcast of uh, unboxing this Ichiban Kuji. So it's it's buried like, um, I think about month back worth of information. So I don't think you can actually find it so easily anymore. So if you guys are interested in this, um, Geki Joban, uh, Macross Delta Ichiban Kuji, um, Shiki Shiwot. Yeah, um, do let me know. Um, or rather, initially, in, in, in the future, <laughs> I will be actually doing, um, uh, how you say, a Kuji style or like whatever I'm doing now to select the people who are uh, going to win a chance to purchase this off me. So, yeah. Uh... <laughs> yeah, oh, thank you, Kai. Uh... Kaylee, <laughs> I almost said Kylie again. <laughs> Kaylee, <laughs> uh, I enjoyed it. Uh, it let me be able to on honestly help profess just what Macross means to me. 
So the method of entry and then how the mods went about selecting their winners was fun. Oh, uh, that's thank that that's sweet. Thank you. So, who's second from the left at the bottom? Um. Oh, you mean left at the bottom? Oh, that's Kanami. So, um, then we have sample. So if you guys haven't seen this before, so yeah. So okay, um. And there is one other thing that's actually inside. Um, I didn't show you guys in the past because it was actually a code. Um, I'm gonna cover this. It's actually a code, a piece of paper, a code. Um, because it is actually a chance to um, win the second chance Ichiban Kuji prize. Um, off the Japanese website but sadly to say this is actually only applicable in Japan so even if you guys actually bought this and you want to try and register this I think there is a method to do to register this but uh, I'm not too sure yeah there is an expiration date um, there is a 9th of May 2018 so um, I'm not too sure whether I can actually do the sale for the Chiban Koji B by then. So honestly speaking, I think this is a bit um useless outside of Japan. So uh, unless you're the kind that really does um commit yourself to actually obtain everything that's in Japan via third person part third party, I don't know. Um, I have never done second Kuji prize chance uh, before in Japan uh, because I'm not too sure how it goes about. I think you may need a Japanese address to have the prize shipped to the, the address. So you need a third party, uh, well, importer, exporter uh, to, to actually send the prize or receive the prize for you. But that is if you actually win it. So uh, one ticket. You, I don't know how lucky you can be with one ticket if you actually buy one of this. So, uh. <laughs> oh, the Shero Ichiban Kuji? Well, the poster has only been promoted. We still don't know when it will be released or what prizes are within the Ichiban Kuji. So, uh, wait for the news. Uh, top right, bottom left. Top right, Mikumo, bottom left, bot oh, so you just want Mikumo. Okay. <laughs> um Okay, so basically right for the Ichiban Kuji, um I will only be leasing out, releasing out um one full entire set as a purchase. Um the others I have actually okay. Let me explain what I have on hand first. I have two sets of entire complete sets. Um, that means including the normal illustrations plus the special ones. Um, as for the special ones, I have an extra set of three. So, only one complete set will be sold as a complete set. While the other complete set will be... Um, how you say um separately sold so you may hit uh the standard versions which is actually more rare surprisingly because there's only like two sets of the standard versions while the special one actually has five sets so um yeah so if you want to stand a chance to get purchased the entire full 10 pieces of different art um that will be basically how this current um, giveaway is going to be held so <laughs> trivia contest jeopardy uh, sadly to say i don't watch jeopardy i don't know what jeopardy is <laughs> in my country there's no jeopardy um there's wheel there was wheel of fortune in the past there was like um what else there's a pyramid game um i have no idea what else is there um i don't watch a lot of tv uh, the only time that I watched TV was when I was still in preschool. Yeah, that was like, what, years ago. Uh, <laughs> so, um, if you guys have any suggestions for um, fun games and, you know, means of uh, winning lucky draws and all this kind of thing, do let me know. 
uh, I love to hear from you guys so that at least I can make things more entertaining for you guys you know to win or stand a chance to get something like this uh, yeah so give me a sec let me go put this down first Okay. Oof. Let me check the polls. Okay, right, we've got five on eight. Uh, seems like eight is dominating. Um, so I guess we're gonna go with eight lines, eight bridges. All right. So, okay, I'm gonna use the black marker. To draw the bridges. Um, okay. So. What? I got lucky and managed to snag a copy of the large Cheryl one recently. What? Which one? What Cheryl? What Cheryl? Large one? I don't know. Hey, he starts here. Hello. There's a lot of hearts flying around. <laughs> okay, so eight lines. Um, all right, there's currently okay. If you take a look at this, um, there is like one, two, three, four, five. There are five gaps in between the lines. So which line, which gap, should I um draw the first line in? Let me know. Uh, write in the comments down below what, uh, which number you will prefer. There's only five gaps, so one to five, e either one of the numbers. So I'll draw the first line in that gap. Um, yeah. Five? Okay, there's one person who said five. <laughs> uh, thanks for joining us, Kevin. Uh, anyone else? No? 1 to 5? I'm just letting you pick the first line. Um, the rest I'll be drawing it on my own. Um, because this is actually... If you, guys, if you guys know your math, this game can be predicted on how you win. So, I'm only letting you choose the first line that I'll draw. <laughs> So there's five, there's two, and there's one. Come on, come on. I need another repeated of the same number. You know, or whichever number that gets mentioned more. There's 10 people watching. Come on, you guys. Uh, I know you can actually like press and enter a comment very fast. I mean, we're in the age of modern technology with SMS and texting. Five, five, uh, five. <laughs> Okay, same number from the same person doesn't count. <laughs> uh, so there's two people who voted for five, three people who voted for five now. Five. Okay, everybody's going for five. Okay, I'm going to draw it on the fifth line. So uh, it's between Alison and Franklin. <laughs> okay. Oh, my line is so ugly. Never mind. Okay. First line is there. Alright, I'm gonna draw the rest of the lines, guys. So, give me a second. Yeah, everyone has voted 5. So, uh, no need to type anything else now. <laughs> you want to pose? Uh, you're a bit late, Emily. I'm so sorry. Uh, <laughs> you did hit 5 on the poll? Oh, that was you? Wait, let me refresh. Oh, okay. What is that paper? <laughs> so, okay, let me explain for those who have just joined us. Um, basically, I've written the six participants who have been selected by the admins at the top. So, um... 
at the bottom, basically, if you see the circle blotch, well, not really a perfect circle, but if you see the blotch of purple, well, it looks black on, on the screen anyway. So, uh, <laughs> um, those are the can badges. Whoever reaches the star will actually win the book. So, we are currently drawing, I'm, or rather, I'm currently drawing the lines um, for you, for the participants to see which prize they will land on. Um, for you currently, um, the comments or rather the, the members of the Micros Delta page have actually voted uh, for eight number of lines to be drawn onto this um, piece of paper then from there you will trace whichever price you land on so um, thank you guys for participating uh, especially if you guys weren't chosen as uh, winners but you know it's it's fun to have the community join in um, the, the crazy um, well, games here. So, oh, there are flowers. You can comp. Wait, you can give flower reaction still. I thought that was removed. Wait, what? Where? Where did the flowers come from? <laughs> okay, so let me just finish up this so that we can end the live broadcast uh, soon. Um, I'm I'm sure most of you guys are probably busy. It's almost end of lunch time periods for the office workers in Singapore and Asian countries so let's quickly do this uh, Mother's Day no it's not Mother's Day uh, okay let me do this I'm gonna draw another line here so one two one two three One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One last line. Did I get it alright? Okay, let me just double check to see if everybody lands on a single prize. Okay, everything seems okay for now. I'm like tracing. Uh... Okay, so that's good. <laughs> Are you guys excited? What's going on? What? Nearly 1 a.m. in USA? Really? I thought it would be like um, 8 or 8 p.m. or so. Oh, I guess like different parts of the, the states is like in different time zones. Have to follow the page more closely so I can watch the next giveaway. <laughs> well, the next giveaway will be when I reach uh, 500. Uh, subscribers on my YouTube channel. So if you guys don't know, I I have been constantly been very active on this Macross Delta group for uh, Uta Macross content and uh, unboxing of Macross goods um, on my YouTube channel that I usually share here on this Macross Delta group. So if you want to know more about me and um, what I do, uh, my, my YouTube channel is um, under the name Silent CL. That's my nickname that I use everywhere. So if you guys see it on, if you see my name in games and all that, that's probably me, Silent CL. Um, so yeah, uh, you can check me out on YouTube. Um, do I need to give you a link? Uh, maybe later. So <laughs> um, I'll see if I can get Colin on it. Got him into Macross this year. Who's Colin? I live in the base, uh, east of Chicago. Oh, wow. Wait, Lou is your Chinese, right? So you're staying in the States? That's cool. Oh, thanks Alex. Uh, putting my name... Uh, yeah, so if you see the Macross Delta admin uh, uh, comment, that's my nickname on my YouTube channel. Uh, yeah. Uh, wow. Oh, it's 12 midnight for some of you guys. <laughs> 
Oops. Okay, I'm so sorry, guys. So, <laughs> uh, I checked the world clock, so I didn't expect it to be this late for some of you guys. So, I'm so sorry. <laughs> it would have been later. Uh, initially, this broadcast was supposed to be like 3 p.m. for me and uh, UTC minus 8 at... Uh, well, eleven p.m. So I, if if I went later, it would be have it will have been like three hours later. Oh dear lord. Okay. So, uh oh, you do know Chinese, Taiwanese. Oh, half Taiwanese. Okay, cool. Uh, um, I will I'll tell you guys about my mixed blood, but um, I I'm I'm like all over the world. So not not me. I I don't travel. So my my bloodline is like from all over the world. So I'm I'm. I am actually one third Mongolian, um, then one third Japanese and one third China man. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, anyways, um, okay. So this is the lines that I've drawn. Uh, I'm gonna paste this on the page for a while. Hopefully, it's close enough for everyone to see. So winners, um, take note of what you have won. And of course, after this live broadcast, do PM me your name that you wish to have on your letter or postage. Um, and send me your mailing address. So congratulations again, guys, um, for those who have won. So I need to shift this up slightly higher because apparently you can't see the prizes. Uh, I only realized this later because of the live broadcast lag on my laptop. So... Here you go guys, thank you guys again so much for the um, the, the constant um, positivity on my YouTube channel from you guys and of course uh, all the fun on the Macross Delta page. Thank you again guys for the, um, well thank you guys again, I mean mostly the admins, thank you the admins for letting me post all my uh, Macross craze. Uh, information so yeah it's a just a bunch of lines so just match have fun matching <laughs> I won't read out the person who won it so um, it's <laughs> trace I mean the, the fun is about tracing so basically you just follow the lines like let's say Frank um, I think here we have Danilia here so just follow the lines then whichever way it goes Yeah, Kaylee won the book. <laughs> so congrats to Kaylee. Uh, the rest of the people get the can badges, so that's pretty nice as well. <laughs> Alright, everyone got it? Oh, don't cry! Tears of joy. <laughs> Alright, so thank you guys, whoever has joined us for the live broadcast. Um, if you guys want to relive this moment again, I will be uploading this onto my YouTube channel so you can always re-watch it from there again. So, thank you guys so much for taking part as always. Uh, I will see you guys in the near future, well, on the Macross Delta page or on my YouTube channel. Until then, bye! Alright, so let me see how do I end this thing. <laughs>